In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Number Frames app, which is now available from the Math Learning Center. To download Number Frames or to check out any of our other great free math apps, visit mathlearningcenter.org apps. Let's get started. The first thing you'll want to do is choose a frame size, and you can do that by tapping the button at the top left-hand corner. You can choose between a set size of 5, 10, 20, or 100, or what's really cool is you can drag this blue box around and choose a custom frame to meet your needs. For this tutorial, I'm going to use the 10 frame. You'll notice once you've selected your frame, it has a blue outline. That means it's selected. Now, once it's selected, I can move it around the workspace. I can rotate it by tapping the rotate button down here. I can duplicate it if I'd like, or I can delete it by tapping the trash can. One of the other neat things that you can do is to show or hide the fives grid. Now it's hidden, now it's showing, and I'm gonna keep it hidden. Let's take a look at our counters. If you tap this gray button down in the lower left-hand corner, a box pops out and you get to choose what your counter looks like, which can be really exciting for students. At the top, we'll do a penguin that's black, and at the bottom, we'll do a ladybug, and we'll keep her red. You can just tap done, and that will close, and your counters are all set up. The counters can be drug into the workspace in three different increments, one, five, or 10. You'll notice that the counters also have the blue outline, meaning that they are also selected, and you can do things like move them around or delete them by tapping the trash can. To select a counter, you can tap them individually, or you can draw a circle around all of them at once, and then they'll all be selected. Let's go ahead and fill up our 10 frame. This time we'll use the ladybugs. I'm gonna go ahead and select four of those and move them out over here so that I can show you another great feature. Um, you can write equations with the Number Frames app by choosing this calculator button down here at the bottom. For this 10 frame, our equation might look something like six plus question mark equals 10. You can choose which color you'd like your um, equation to be. You can choose between black, red, or blue. I think we'll make it red to match our ladybugs. Tap done, and then you can move this equation anywhere you'd like on the screen. Another great feature are the drawing tools. To open the drawing tools, just tap the pen down here in the toolbar, and they'll appear right over here on the right. You have a red pen and a blue pen. I'm gonna use blue. You can do things like circle your counters or solve the equation. If you need to erase, we have two erasers. One, you just draw to erase. And one, you can just erase all of your drawing work at once. To close the drawing tools, just tap the X. If you'd like additional information about any of the features included in the Number Frames app, just tap the information button at the bottom right hand corner. You'll find some information about number frames, but you'll also find a guide to all of its great features. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoy using the Number Frames app. Number frames are featured in Bridges and Mathematics Second Edition. For more information about bridges, visit mathlearningcenter.org/bridges.